I'm at the Green Living Show and I'm talking to Tova, uh, who's going to teach us about personal care products that you can apply in your home as if you're at a spa. Is that right? That's right. They're also a great product to extend the treatments you get from your spa and help you maintain the great benefits you get from the spa to your next treatment. Great. So what would you recommend first? Well, first you want to uh, have a nice soak uh, with the my sea soap, which is a blend of dead sea salts, Epsom salts, uh, dendritic salt, and essential oils. And those salts are going to draw the toxins out of your, your system, uh, increase blood circulation. Uh, if you suffer from eczema or uh, psoriasis, it will help calm your condition, and it will just give you an all-around relaxing sensation. Now, why do you use so many different combinations of salts? Uh, they all have different beneficial qualities. Uh, the dendritic salt I actually put in there to maintain the scent of the essential oils. Uh, the, the essential oils can cling to the star-shaped uh, salts that are uh, the dendritic salt. Okay, um, so basically you need to take a bath with these salts? You do. Okay, I guess if you're going to do it every day, you know, have the luxury to do it every day, once, once a week will be good, that'll help yeah. detoxify Absolutely. the body, it's good maintenance? Yes. Great, okay. What are they saying at the show regarding that? Oh, they're loving it. It's a great product. It's all natural. Does anyone really know how to do this? Like, most people just take showers. Yeah, there's, there's shower people and bath people, but a lot of shower people want to try it. Excellent. Okay, what do you got next? Uh, then I have my Castile soap. It's made with an artisanal virgin olive oil. It uh, is made with essential oils as well. It's all natural because it's just olive oil. It's a really great shaving bar as well. It's, it's more of a slippery consistency, so the razor just glides. You're not being left uh, dry like you would with a shaving cream. There's no chemicals. Now, I know that other companies use olive oil in their soaps too. What would we make that different? Uh, a lot of other soap companies, they use a blend of oils. It could be olive oil, but there's also usually shea butter, coconut oil, um, uh, palm kernel oil, which is actually wiping out our rainforest, so I refuse to use that one. Um, okay. I just wanted a, a true Castile bar, which is a bar made only with olive oil. And I found a, a, an award-winning olive oil supplier that's local to me, so I, I can cut down my carbon footprint by having someone that's 10 minutes down the road rather than you know, 200 uh, miles somewhere else. Great, and I know you got different, what, flavors here? Patchouli, pink grapefruit, lemongrass, yes. house blend. Tell me about that. Do uh, they serve a different function? Um, I don't flavor the bars for functionality. They, because it's a rinse off product, you're going to get a, 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 an oral sensation, uh, not oral. <laughs> sensation, but it's not, I'm not claiming that you're going to, it's going to heal anything or, okay. uh, it's just about scent. Good. Smell good. Yeah. Great. Okay, after you uh, clean up with the soap, you yeah. then would go to a... My sugar polish, actually. This, this is just a my two-ounce, it's a sugar polish. Do guys do that? They do. Sugar they polish. Do. Okay, I haven't, so teach me. <laughs> I'm learning something here. Sugar, so a sugar polish, after you've soaked in the tub, then you've... Uh, wash with the soap and you've rinsed off. You're going to take the sugar polish, you're going to massage it into your skin. Um, the sugar is going to gently exfoliate your skin. Mm -hmm. And the oils that I've used in the sugar polish, which is apricot kernel oil, uh, the virgin olive oil, the pumpkin seed oil, and essential oils, when you rinse them off, you're actually going to be moisturized from those oils. So you've exfoliated and moisturized all in one step. Good. And, uh, what are they saying at the show here regarding they're that? They're loving it. I actually sold out of my 8-ounce size. You sold should, out? It's a little jar. Yeah, we're This is only Saturday. <laughs> when did yeah. you sell out? Was, today? Yeah, Yesterday? I sold out today. Wow. Yeah. Okay. So how do we know more about this? How long have you been doing this? Uh, I've been in business for three years. Uh, I've been making soap for nine years. Uh, and we're in uh, several spas in Ontario and three on the West Coast. Who's your main client? Is it the consumers or the spas? The spas. Excellent. We're, we're a spa product that helps the spa client get to their next appointment. Great. So if you can't go to the spa because of time or finances or distance, you can just can bring it, it home. Yes. Excellent. Your website, uh, Tova? Uh, Tlanghands.com. Great. Thank you so much.